So in today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to sign up for a chess.com account so you can save all your progress, all your games, and you can do everything within a chess account. So what you want to do is go to your favorite web browser. It could be any browser, Chrome, Firefox, um, Edge, whatever it is really. The most important thing is to go to chess.com. That's the main chess.com website. And this is a homepage and that's what it looks like. So to create an account, go to the left hand side panel and click on sign up. And then it's going to take you to this account creation page. Now, if you want to, you can continue with Google and that basically means you're going to sign up and be logging in with your Google account, or you can do this with your Apple ID or with facebook.com. But if you want to sign up with a separate account, an independent account, which is what I recommend, what you want to do is click on sign up, okay? And then choose if you're new to chess, if you're a beginner, intermediate, advanced, depending on your skill level. I'll just select new to chess and click on continue and then provide your email address. And once you put in your email address, the website might automatically generate for you a password, which you can go ahead and use, but you might want to create your own password. So you can delete that and put in your own password. And then click on continue. Let me just put in a different password because you have to follow the rules. The password, as it says, has to be at least eight characters, one caps lock, and one number. So let me just put an appropriate password. And then click on continue. And then choose the username you want to be using to play on chess.com. So I'm just going to select a random username like... Uh, like, like that and then click on continue oh that's taken so let's try something else that seems to be available so hit continue choose the chessboard theme you want I'll just go for the standard because you can always change this stuff later and then click on continue then it's going to ask you uh, if you want to invite your Facebook friends or send email invites to your friends. I'll just choose later to do this later. And then, of course, because you're signing up, you're going to be offered with one week of premium chess.com, which you can take. But I'll just uh, recommend clicking on no thank you to use the free account. And then later, if you want to get chess.com premium, I'll show you in another video how to subscribe for that. Uh, so there you go. Just get notified when it's your move. No, thank you. Or okay, depending on what you want. And that's it. We are now inside chess.com. And you're now signed into your account. And when you see no option to log in or sign up, it means you're basically already logged in to your chess.com account. Now, if you want to go to your chess profile, just put your mouse pointer over chess.com in the top left corner and then click on profile. And that will open your chess.com profile. Now, mine has nothing yet, but of course, after I continue using the account and editing the profile, I'll just have more in uh, in there. But that's basically how to create a chess.com account or how to sign up on chess.com. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.